Okay, welcome back to Beyond Seclusion. I like to review and test anything, anything that I like that's related to what I like doing, hunting, fishing, and shooting. I got some new eye protection. Recently, I have become very interested in eye protection was testing my subsonic ammo in my AK, and this happened. Yeah. Um, still trying to figure out what's going on. Sent it back to Silencer Co. I had to put an adapter on my AK because it's got an odd thread pitch. I took it to a gunsmith that I don't normally use out of convenience because I thought, you know, how difficult is it to check alignment? Now, I'm not saying that it is the gunsmith's fault. I don't know because I couldn't find any of the internals of the suppressor because they all shot out into four foot high grass. And after doing several FOD walks with the kids, we were not able to find any of the parts. Uh, I took the gun back to the gunsmith. They're gonna check alignment. They're telling me the alignment was good. Yeah, I don't know, anyway. I wanted to make sure that I had some decent eye protection. I bought, like many of you, just, you know, some cheap stuff, thinking, hey, this is going to work. Um, and I wanted to be able to change the lenses. So anyway, you know, did a little research, talked to some of my buddies in the military, and Wiley, okay? Wiley X, this seems to be a reputable brand. A lot of you probably already know this, but hey, you know, I'm usually day late, dollar short. So anyway, I got these. You know, we open them up out of the box here and I'll show you. It's an awesome deal with this. Okay, so after looking at a whole lot of their products and searching around, for me, I found the best deal on Amazon. And yeah, I purchased these. These weren't sent to me. I've got a couple here listed on my Amazon page. The top two that I was looking at, uh, the Rogue, I went with this. The big thing why I went with this was basically the anti-fog lenses. That's one of the biggest problems that I have with my eye protection is fogging. You know, if I go inside or outside or it's hot, you know, cold. And, you know, the reviews on this showed that, you know, they have this special coating. So that's why I went with these comfortable interchangeable lenses you know we've got three different options we've got the clear we've got the rust and then we've got obviously the the shaded or the gray for on sunny days that's typically what i'm going to be using but there are a lot of days that i don't want shaded i want light enhancing like the rust or the clear these pop in and out relatively easy. The nose piece is also adjustable. Another reason I like it, and they are comfortable, guys. I really like these. If you're like me, over the years, you've spent already, you know, 50 bucks on the cheap crap that breaks, that scratches. Buy a good pair once. You've got them for life. They've got a ton of features. They got a strap here. It's got a nice case that I can put them in and keep them from getting scratched. If you like this review and you like the Beyond Seclusion YouTube channel, check us out on Facebook. You can help support us by using our links. Example, these glasses I've got on my Amazon page. Any of you that shop on Amazon, if you go in through our link, that helps support Beyond Seclusion. That's huge. That helps fund the ammo and products when they're not sent for review. Also using our links on our web page, that's big. Check us out on Facebook. Thanks for your support. Now this is the rust colored lenses. To me, I guess I would call them yellow. They're calling them rust. These are great for cloudy days, overcast. They actually seem to make things brighter. And then we can also go to the clear. And I gotta say, they're awesome quality lenses, really clear. These are perfect for, because in some of my videos when I'm using optics, when I'm sighting in or I'm doing accuracy tests. Yeah, I got to thinking, why reinvent the wheel? So I did a little search and I found this from Wiley. 
Right here is our ballistic machine. We have three barrels that encompass this machine, which shoot three different projectiles. An ANSI steel ball, 22 caliber fragment. And a 15 caliber fragment, your ANSI steel ball is going to come out your first barrel. It's going to travel at 150 feet to 160 feet per second. Your 15 caliber fragment is going to come out of your second barrel. It's going to travel from 640 to 660 feet per second. And your 22 caliber is going to travel from 550 to 560 feet per second. To give you an example of what it does to these lenses, is this was shot with a 15 caliber twice in virtually the same spot. It received the impact, it absorbed the energy, and when you feel on the back side of the lens, it's as smooth as the rest of the lens with zero penetration. So I've been wearing these now for at least about a month. And I love them, guys. For the money and the reputation, the reliability, you just can't beat them. Anyway, I've got the link in the description to these on my Amazon page. You know, I found just the basic set for as low as $32. This set that I had had the three different lenses, um, and I can't remember what it was, but it, it's worth the money if you do a lot of shooting. you got to protect your eyes' safety first. Anyway, I hope you found this helpful. Be sure to like, comment, and sub. Until next time, happy shooting, and be safe.